Hey guys, Cal Torak here. Today, I want to show you how I was able to make over 100,000 gold in the first week of Cata launch. I was able to max both engineering and tailoring on my brand new mage, buy my volcanic deck, and make sure I have enough gold for consumes, gems, and enchants for raid start. I honestly didn't do much prep going into this expansion. I started launch with less than 1,000 gold and didn't have an army of profession alts set up in advance. Here's what I did to make all my gold. The first thing I want to talk about is Potion of Treasure Finding. I'm honestly kind of salty I just found out about this yesterday. I've been farming for days without using this potion. This potion is insane and makes mobs in Cata Zones have a chance to drop tiny treasure chests. These chests have a chance to have raw gold in them and some pretty incredible items. I banked 200 of them for this video which took me around 5 hours to farm. From these 200 chests I got 61 Volatile Fire. 60 Volatile Water, 52 Volatile Earth, 83 Volatile Life, 49 Volatile Air, 55 Elementium Ore, 54 Pyrite Ore, 14 BOE Greens, 940 Ember Silk Cloth, and roughly 700 Raw Gold. In total from these 200 chests, I gained 20,000 gold after it all sold. This doesn't include all the gold I farmed outside of these chests. During my time at this farm, I have also gotten several BOE Blues and over 10,000 Ember Silk Cloth. I've done almost all my farming in this location in Deep Hole. It's a pretty well known location. A lot of speed levelers leveled up here, as did I. This is also a well known location from back in the day, so not like it's new at all. As you can see here, it's often pretty contested. I was able to bully other people out of my spots though, by using Invis and Fast Tags Blizzard. I'm not really going to do a guide for this farm, there are plenty of guides out there already, and it's pretty straightforward. For the first few days I was listing greens on the auction house, some BOE greens were selling for several hundred gold on day one. After that though, I leveled enchanting from 325 to 425 on my old priest alt, and started mass sending her greens to DE. My priest has made over 10,000 gold from selling DE mats. I didn't have TSM on for the first day and a half of launch, so I'm missing some gold earned tracked. I've made well over 150,000 gold since launch though. If I would have been using treasure finding potions from day one, I'd be doing way better off. Either way though, I am very happy with the amount of gold I've been able to make since launch. To put it into perspective how much 150,000 gold is, the gold token is only 5,600 gold. That's over $500 in tokens, so yeah, I'm pretty happy. Anyways, this farm spot is pretty great. It's nice being able to do blizzard farming again, even with ember silk dropping in price. With the treasure finding boxes, it's still very solid gold per hour. Again, it's super contested, but I've been farming here all week. Learn how to secure tags and how to bully people away from your spot, and you'll be fine. Best of luck, and see you in the next one, boys.